Hello, welcome to our channel. Now in this video, we will tell you about the cast of Magnum P.I. How the 1980s changed. I'll show you how they looked then in 1980 and now in 2022, how they've changed compared to when they were on the show. Right, let's go. Larry Manetti. In the movie, he plays Orville Rick Wright. In 1980, he was 33 years old and now he is 75 years old. Stop for a massage? It's part of the deal. Never mind. Are you alright? Yeah. Well, what'd you get on? So it's, it's the first time that I've heard him be boist boisterous about it, said that he really wants to do it, so I'm impressed. I think it'll. Tom Selleck. In the movie, he plays Thomas Magnum. In 1980, he was 35 years old, and now he is 77 years old. In Tokyo, on official business, no matter what Cooley says. Now, there had to be something in Japan that NIA was investigating. Relax the new actors, because yeah. that's really hard to come on a to show walk where in. everybody's up to speed. It's like when I do. Russia, E. Mosley. In the movie, he plays Theodore T.C. Calvin. In 1980, he was 42 years old, and it was with great sadness that on August the 4th, 2022, Mosley was involved in a car accident and died three days later from his injuries at Cedar Sinai Medical Center at the age of 83. Oh, hey man, I'm in a panic to get out of here. But just what happens that Thomas Magnum borrowed internationally making it well known. And in that show, we went through almost through the whole show with a bug in Larry's head. And he didn't know the bug was... John Hitlerman. In the movie, he plays Jonathan Higgins. In 1980, he was 48 years old and it was with great sadness that on November 9, 2017, he died of cardiovascular disease at his home in Houston, age 84. Well, I wouldn't say that. But at least I can tell Mr. Masters we have the original back. You called Robin? I have a here. It's the highest now. They're paying more for it than any show in history, or something. Are like you that. getting a large chunk of that? Jeff McKine in the movie he plays Lieutenant Mark McRenos. In 1980, he was 32 years old, and to his dismay, McKine died of liver failure on August 22, 2008, uh, in Tusa. Oklahoma at the age of 59. I know you're conning me. Oh, come on, Max. Just push the buttons. What's the name? Tobin. Eric Tobin. The county is home to Jeff, and he's working to protect it. Judge Jeff McKay's life has been... Lance Lagarde. In the film, he plays Colonel Buck Green. He was 45 years old in 1980, and it was with great sadness that Lagarde died of heart failure on Monday, September the 10th, 2012, at his home in Los Angeles at the age of 77. General Way is no longer of any interest to us. My only concern right now is, Michelle, if you find it. Well, she really no good for you, but that's all right. That's all right. Alicia Cook Jr. in the movie he plays Francis Icepick Haas Stetler. He was 77 years old in 1980 and it was with great sadness that Alicia Cook Jr. died of a stroke at the age of 91 on May 18, 1995 at a nursing home in Big Pine, California. You sit there and you... You will sit by me. Could very easily. Very easily I could. Because I've been killed in every shape and form there is. You you can't name it that I've been killed. Kwan He Lim. In the movie he plays Lieutenant Josie Tanaka. In nineteen eighty he was fifty eight years old and it was with great sadness that Kwan He Lim passed away from a non communicable disease on December the twenty two. 2008 at the age of 86. You found Joni 
but you got there too soon before the murder was. Thanks for watching the whole video. If you like this video, please share it. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel to support us in producing the next video.